Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Cloud and AI Analytics. Hope everyone is doing good. I am Vignesh and in this playlist Mastering SQL and Cloud BigQuery in Google Cloud Platform, we will be starting by discussing the different analytics challenges faced by the data professional and especially when they are working with on-prem systems. So there are a lot of challenges. Earlier if you run any query on on-prem, let's say the data is very huge then you can go out or even you can have your dinner or you can do whatever you need to do while your query will be still in the running stage only. So those queries will be taking too long to complete that could potentially stall your data analytics or in case if you wanted to combine data from different sources let's say like we have 15 different sources when you are combining them and when you are trying to query on those data again this will be very hard to do and if you observe very closely it is not the problem with your SQL queries obviously there may be but the real problem it would be with your infrastructure so I'm a data engineer from a data team and not from an infrastructure team I don't know how to buy an hardware or I don't know how to buy servers or storing multiple versions of hard drives or also even if something fails I don't know really how to fix it and it's not just with that the next point is like with networking and accessing issues with the data. When you work with on-prem, you must be the one who should configure the networking and also you, are, you should think about how to access the data when the data is actually stored in different system. And the next challenge is, that is a pretty apparent one, that is cost. So you have ton of data to process but you can't afford the infrastructure to just process all of it because the limitations with the system configured in your on-prem. For example, in your on-prem you can process only 100 GB of volume of data but let's say you get one terabyte of data how you can process obviously if you process that will take long time even if it takes long time also we are not pretty sure that will that it will complete at some point of time it can break also you have no central place where you can just dump all your data into like a staging area or like a data analytics warehouse or databases that could be also a problem and the next point is there is always a confusion between there's a too much of data to process or the data is not connected. So these are the two common problems faced data engineers or data analysts in on-prem system and on-prem clusters or in scaling with analysis. So this is again a huge problem. It's like fixed. It can only process 100 GB just because you get one terabyte of volume of data, you, your cluster cannot automatically scale up. So traditional databases are not up for the challenges of data of this scale. And the next point is time and money being spent at wrong places. If you look at the most of the big data projects where time and money is being spent, you see the most of the time is be spending not on getting insights from the data, but trying to fix the problem of your infrastructure. And moving on to the next point, we have three main problems usually when we're trying to do data analytics. The first one is querying the infrastructure and the storage. So with querying, the queries can take too long or have heavy complicated logics as well. And the next one is infrastructure. So with infrastructure, it should be very easy to scale based on the volume of the data and also it should be very easy to do the maintenance as well. And the third one is storage. So the capacity should be very high so you can store a huge volume of the data. Let's say if you wanted to store petabyte or zettabyte volume of the data also, you should be able to do it. Along with this, you should also need computing power, networking admin, hardware teams to maintain and upgrade your infrastructure and not to mention you don't need to spend separately on software and software license cost. So these are the various different challenges faced by data professionals on on-prem system. So how to solve this problem? Where to ask for solution? You can ask solution from the top cloud providers like AWS, Azure and GCP. And we will see how GCP comes to the rescue with a big data service called Cloud BigQuery. So Cloud BigQuery is the data warehouse solution offered by Google Cloud Platform. And it can help you with the storage and computation. Basically, you don't need to worry or manage the infrastructure that is storage and computation. It will be taken care by the cloud provider itself. So the cloud BigQuery also designed with scalability in mind. So it is basically a serverless service and you can go global also with this service. And with cloud BigQuery, you can just focus on writing query and finding meaningful insights from the data. Not to worry about the storage, not to worry about the infrastructure. That means you don't need to worry about the computation, storage, networking, hardware. Don't need to worry about anything. Those things will be taken care by Google Cloud 
as a user of google cloud bigquery you have to just write query and finding meaningful insights from the data so these are the different advantages when you're doing data analytics with cloud bigquery platform and basically you don't need to build anything by yourself when you can leverage google's massive infrastructure that is cloud bigquery so these are the different challenges faced by the data professionals on on-prem and how google cloud's cloud bigquery comes to the rescue so in the upcoming videos we will explore a lot about cloud bigqueries and sql in this playlist if you have any questions please do post that in the comment section i'll take a look at it and reply to it as soon as possible please do like comment share and subscribe to cloud and ai analytics i'll meet you in the next video until then it's bye from viknesh happy learning